Turner. This is the Michelle Medler Quartet with Michelle Medler, Dan Gilday, Edwin Coleman 3, E3 on drums, and Ben Medler. This song is called Pink Sky.
looks like our dog is it's enjoying us. So that was that was Pink Sky. Yeah. Um, and you have a dedication for this one. I do have a dedication for this one. This is dedicated to my dad, who was a great guy. He passed this last year, uh, dealing with two kinds of cancer. One was leukemia. And he worked until three weeks before he passed. I always knew he was going to be a hard worker like that. Anyway, I was having a, a rough go of it and uh, decided to uh, take Duke Ellington's advice. His advice is to, I, his quote is, I merely took the energy it takes to pout and wrote some blues. And so I followed his advice and I sat down and it's just really helpful to be able to compose music and get stuff out, you know. So I was going through that when I wrote this song and, you know, that when you sit down and write with a computer, it asks you all kinds of questions as you start. What key is this supposed to be in? Like, you know, how many bars is it going to be? You know, what's the title? I don't know. I haven't written it yet. Shouldn't I? I don't know. So I, I'll look around or I'll think about current events. And I looked out my window and the sky was this beautiful, saturated pink. And so that was the name of the song, Pink Sky. And this time the name stuck. Sometimes they're really silly and they don't stick. <laughs> but anyway, that's how this one came about. So, and Edwin had a story, it said, uh, it's an E2 story about your dad, um, and the prompt was, bring your cymbals to the gig. Bring my cymbals to the gig. Uh, when I first started playing with my dad's trio, he didn't uh, allow me to bring a ride cymbal. Just a hi-hat, snare, and a kick. <laughs> it was just the old, yeah, you know, the old school style. Yeah. Um, keep time on that hat, hi-hat, on that sock hat, he called it. No wild souls. No, no wild <laughs> souls. Right here. You wait your turn. turn. Swing. You wait your turn. And about a year of that, and before a gig, I was loading gear, and he said, all right, you can bring that ride symbol out. <laughs> Did you already have it packed up? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was always ready. It was always, <laughs> always <laughs> ready. <laughs> yeah, yeah I, brought the, I brought the ride symbol to the gig. It swung pretty good. I got to ask. Cool. You, you never asked? If I could, can I bring the right symbol this week? I did a few times. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 So I was wondering. Yeah, I was just wondering. Yeah. Be alright if I yeah. brought a symbol this time? Yeah. Yeah. I promise I won't play it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to look at it. Just want to look at it. <laughs> you see, my friends, they keep coming and seeing me playing without a symbol, and I'm not so cool. So right. I, I got to have that symbol yeah. up there. <laughs> but it's kind of cool that, that he said, yeah. You weren't, you weren't, you didn't prompt him. No, 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 no that's not. I got, I got used to playing without it. Yeah, yeah. And, and then, then you just went full Neil Peart. Phil, yeah. Like the, <laughs> the biggest kit you could bring Tony to the game. Tony Williams. <laughs> Phil's. No. 13 drums. Yeah, no. Yeah. No. I had a short phase of all that stuff. Yeah. But Mine was maybe not a little with his, Not with his gigs, yeah. <laughs> right. His gigs, there's no Tom. I didn't play with Tom's for years with him. Right. You kept the Roto Tom's at home, huh? Yeah, he yeah, yeah, stayed yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Very cool. All right. Well, we hope you enjoyed Pink Sky. There will be more podcasts to come. Michelle Mendler Quartet. Thanks, everybody. Cheers. It's hard to